Hey, it's Matt from McGee Farms and got a couple Amazon packages in this week and was going to open them up, kind of uh, show them off a little bit and then as we get them set up, kind of show you uh, how they work out. Uh, ordered these the other day. You know, we've got our new PFAL pin that we're setting up and also we got our chicken house and I was looking in to try to get some kind of a solar lighting set up and uh, I'd seen these, a buddy of mine actually got these and I'll put a link to them uh, on, the, on the notes for the description for, the, for this video. But uh, they're small solar lights, they've got a little thing to hang. A buddy of mine uses these in his tent sometimes and he's had real good luck with them. They're cheap, so I figure, well, why not try them out? So uh, opening them up, looking through, like I said, the lights look pretty, uh, pretty nice. Kind of impressed with them. The only thing I'm not overly crazy about is the solar panel. It doesn't really have a way to mount it. It looks like, uh, I don't know if this is like a, yeah, a sticky thing where you just kind of peel and stick. I don't know how well, you know, that's really going to hold up over time. But again, these were super cheap, so... You know, if, if they don't work out, I'm not out that much money. But you just have a small solar panel. Hook up with a, uh, uh, looks like a C connector maybe, uh, like a phone C connector. And it came as a two-pack, so I ended up with, with two of them. Two of these and two little remote controls. I don't know how... Uh, how much I'm going to be using the remote controls. I've got some other solar lights at the house with uh, remote control and I don't think I've ever put batteries in it. But I don't know, maybe this might be nice for uh, you know setting them up and if I want to turn them on or off from the house. It does have a setting on here though for where it'll be super bright for 30 minutes, not quite so bright for two hours, all the way out to like an eight hour setting. And my thinking is uh, twofold. One, as far as uh, leaving some lights on, it'll maybe help them. Uh, you know, if we have predator problems, I'm working on the predator problems right now. Uh, and hopefully uh, by the time they become a problem next spring, they won't be a problem. But also as we get into where they're not laying as many eggs because of the, uh, the less daylight, you know, this might be a way if uh, we're wanting more eggs, we can do that. So I'm going to get these set up today and I will uh, make a video once we get them in there and kind of show you how they're working. And then after, I'm sure it's going to take all day to charge them, but if they're working at night, we'll go out and take a look at how they're working tonight. It's Matt with McGee Farms. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you enjoy all the videos. If you like it, please consider giving us a thumbs up down there at the bottom, leaving some comments, or subscribing to the channel. It's always appreciated, and it helps the channel. Till next time, have a great day.